this is a story of of a few pieces fighting the battle against a queen white queen i mean any queen is a, usually a powerful piece and it it can usually win the game by itself but when it is faced with the power of three pieces working together then it's very difficult for the queen to stay strong in this position white has a pass pawn black has two pass pawns and he has got three pieces working in coordination in such situations what usually happens is black one of the black pieces do not get defended and it gets picked up using a fork so basically right now everything is guarding each other so it's fine for black let's see what happens white plays a4 understandable he wants to promote the pawn like push it forward and make it a threat rook check king moves to safety rook a1 so stress has done this very nicely he has put his rook behind the pawn so that if queen moves away you can just take it now his next threat is to start pushing his pawns right white plays check king moves up queen takes pawn so one pawn is gone but black still has got one pass pawn and three pieces against the queen material wise it's he is winning black is winning but mistakes can happen and here he plays a nice looking move bishop check basically picking up this pawn the pawn cannot move anywhere right uh the engine suggests a nice move here for for white white seems to have this move queen c3 that move stops so it actually wins because now the bishop and the rook attack so this is how pieces fall off this is the only way you can pick up pieces with the queen but say i mean drew did not sorry drew did not see that he just plays queen c7 it doesn't make any sense because he is going to pick the pawn just promote protecting the next square that the pawn is moving to does not help the pawn will not no longer be there in the next move to move there so black plays d4 getting the pawn even further up queen d6 rook takes a4 so again you can see rook is covering this pawn bishop is guarding this rook and knights already protected the pieces are working together against the queen after queen c6 the pawn just goes forward now it becomes a big threat because it just needs two steps and you can be guarded by bishop c2 so queen comes here but bishop c2 it's completely winning for black now uh, white stops it by blocking it but then black has one more piece to be used first he puts rook behind the pawn keeping it completely safe and then he plays knight d5 so he is going to attack this queen somehow like for example knight b6 and then knight c4 and then push push queens king f2 he does that knight b6 now he could have just go oh, he could not have pushed because the rook was hanging so the rook goes all the way back king comes here which is actually a big mistake because d2 comes now queen takes queen had to give itself up because white was black was going to queen next move so it takes and this is a simple conversion for shreyas and he went on to win the game and he did it in nice fashion just getting the king up exchanging of one pawn and taking the other pawn and then he starts pushing us past pawn he didn't have to save the knight but okay and he queens no stalemate it just checkmate next move so that was a nice way of showing how the queen can be handled by three pieces working together and in this case it was rook bishop and knight